All right, we're out here at Road America for a IndyCar series race. Uh, I partnered up with Honda. They sponsored this video, and a huge thanks to them because I'm getting to experience a once in a lifetime opportunity. I'm going to be able to ride with and talk to Mario Andretti himself. You don't know who he is. I'm heavily ashamed of you. You should know who he is. I shouldn't have to explain that part. Uh, we're going to ride a two-seat Indy car. I'm going to finally get to experience what the G-forces and all of that are like. And one of these cars is just like three, four, five Gs. In comparison, we're pulling less than probably a G and drifting. So this is going to be an insane experience. And I'm really excited to actually be able to see what this is like for the drivers and have a better appreciation of it. Mario Andretti, like I said before, if you guys don't know who Mario Andretti is, I don't know what to talk to you about because that's just <laughs> terrible. Terrible. Um, I'm gonna ask him some questions because it's not very often I get to meet a legend like you and ask you questions, so it's pretty exciting. Um, so we were just kind of talking about this, but have you ever drifted before in like an indie car? Have you ever, you know? Uh, as we chatted, uh, I've drifted as close as I came to drifting was driving on a dirt track. Okay. You know, with the midget sprint car or a champ car, and uh, that was very popular back in the '60s and '70s. You know. Uh, it was about mid 70s when I stopped driving the dirt, but okay. uh, but I, I love that tremendously because uh, for man, many reasons. Because even for for a championship in a IndyCar series, you had to be able to drive a dirt track, a road <laughs> course, a regular super speedway. Really? You know, you know, you had to be able to do all of these, uh, and uh, so to me, obviously, it was the most diversified. Uh, Motorsport championship. Oh, wow, yeah. I didn't even know that. That year, I won races on a road course, I won Indy, and I won even Pikes Peak, and I won actually on the dirt. So uh, I caught a little, all bit of of the, the, a little bit of everything to go toward the championship. So uh, from my standpoint, that was probably the, the proudest championship that I've had because of all the different varieties that uh, that I was able to win in. Yeah, it wasn't one specific thing that right. you just got really good at one thing. You had to be good at everything, I mean, yeah, jack of all trades. Yeah, that's one thing that kept me motivated you know, in my entire career. You know, even going to different disciplines, you know, to be curious, to try to find out what's going on on the other side of the box. See know, what it's you know, like. Yeah, what it's like. A lot of misconception as far as what the physical effort is to right. drive a race car. And, uh, but um, again, uh, you just have to try yourself. Then you That's what I'm excited it's, for. It's different than, uh, than what a lot of people think. Absolutely. If I pull five Gs, that means my skeleton's got to stay on like a thousand pounds. Wow, piloting a car. I mean, that's insane. All right, well, um, that wraps up the interview portion. Now we're going to be driving, riding. He's going to be driving, obviously. I'm going to be riding. I'm super excited for this four mile road course in an Indy car. I've never experienced anything even close to this caliber. So this is gonna be a really interesting experience for me. I'm super excited. Thank you for the yeah. interview. My pleasure. Definitely a pleasure. We're ready. I'm excited. I feel professional here walking in the in the race suit. So this is obviously what I'm gonna be riding in. I'm not quite sure how I'm gonna fit back there. It's crazy, that's how they make tight turns. So excited. It's gonna be really fun. I think it's gonna be more intense than I expected, but in a good way. sections we're going through so fast that I just I don't know it feels like there's no possible way you can go that fast through there but you can because all the downforce and such but it just doesn't seem real when you're in it. It doesn't seem possible. Great. Oh, that was intense. Goodbye Mario thank Bye. you for the ride. 
Much it was pleasure. awesome. Thank you for the interview. Much, uh, enjoyed having you. Hopefully next, I'll see you again soon. Next time you drive. Yeah, all right. All right, I can do that. <laughs> okay. See you later. All right, I have to leave soon, but before I leave, I want to show you guys like a quick walk around of the track as much as I can walk because it's a big track and it'll take a lot of time to walk. The whole thing, but you'll get the idea. We're going down to the pits now. This is what the pits look like. trip here to Road America. Super, super, super fun trip. I definitely never thought I'd be riding in a two-seat Honda Indy car with Mario Andretti ever in my life. So, oh, what a fabulous experience. Huge thank you again to Honda for making this trip happen and sponsoring this video and this trip for me because this was a dream of a lifetime. Like being able to really experience an Indy car race to like to this level, riding in the car and walking through the pits and seeing all the ins and outs of the behind the scenes and stuff was just phenomenal and riding in the car gave me such a huge like new appreciation for the sport i mean i already had a huge appreciation for it but like feeling how hard the, they're breaking into those turns and like how fast you're going through the turns like the cars have an immense amount of grip through the turns it's just it's mind-blowing uh, that's it for this video thank you guys for watching thanks for subscribing i will see you next time Bye.